Let's say you want your colors to your models to start off with one solid color. What you would do is you would either put down white or black primer. I recommend Rust-Oleum uh, flat white primer, Painter's Touch uh, sub brand, or Krylon Ultra Flat Black. This makes the paint stick to the metal. Now, if you want your guys to be all red, you can use Design Master uh, Red paint. This is an acrylic spray. And you got to make sure you get at it from all angles so there's not a bald spot. Most of the time what people will do is they'll lay their models down flat and kind of spray them from, you know, the under angle, then set them, then do the other side, then set them up right and kind of hit them from the, the top angles. Again, you don't want to layer on this huge crustification of paint. Um, the wonderful Games Workshop uh, acrylics, um, they come in a wide variety of colors. They're very nice. Uh, another option is to um, buy a Design Master brand acrylic paints. You can find these at craft shops. And uh, those come in a wide variety of colors. Uh, as far as I can tell, there's uh, not uh, any difference between the two items. And you can really save yourself a lot of time with that technique. If, uh, if your models are 80% one color, let's say they have solid blue armor almost exclusively, then um, putting down a solid blue coat over the entire model really is a great way to go.